Actually, it's true. Thank you. Because the uh, pastor asked me to share some testimony. Uh, pastor about my Athena Twitter's world. And he said, you can say something short. And I said, say not cold. But God is so big and great. My God is so stupid. It's impossible to say something short. So they are open to say not cold. It's impossible. Yes. Uh, because um, I was thinking, what, what can I share? Because uh, every day of my life, it's a great testimony. Jag tänkte, vad ska jag dela för varje dag i mitt liv? Det är så fantastiskt. But anyway, I want to share like uh, my story. Så jag ska prata lite om, om min historia. Because I'm not an ordinary immigrant here in Sweden. Jag är inte en vanlig immigrant här i Sverige. I came here to Sweden because of the war. Jag kom hit på grund av kriget. And uh, you know, like uh, we have a lot of Questions: Why, why God is everything is happening right now? Och vi har så många frågor och vi säger varför Gud, varför, varför händer det som händer just nu? But we, we don't have an answer. Vi har inget svar. But I know everything. All we have is only faith. Uh, men jag vet att det vi har det är tro. And trust to God. Och tillit till Gud. Uh, I remember first day when I came here to Sweden. Jag kom här första dagen som jag kom hit till Sverige. I was so glad, like, oh, maybe my God will, my, my life will change here and it's, it's going to be an amazing life. Jag var så glad, jag tänkte kanske livet blir fantastiskt här. But uh, my expectations was a bit different from reality. Men mina förväntningar, de stämde inte alls överens med verkligheten. I came here, I had no money. Jag kom hit, jag hade inga pengar. I had no job. Inget jobb. And the worst of all. Och det värsta. I did, I couldn't speak any language except of mine. Jag kunde inte tala något annat språk än mitt eget. I couldn't speak English. Jag kunde inte förstå ens när folk pratade engelska. We we not gonna take this with you. It's not with English. Uh, it's enough that I think I couldn't speak English. Jag kunde inte prata engelska. So uh, I remember the day when I was just crying. Or or I cried. Uh, because like I don't have anything. I don't know nobody here in this country. Och jag tänkte jag har ingen tid och jag känner ingen i det här landet. And I called to my father. Och jag ringde till min pappa. And he said like, Alika, why are you worried? Och han sa, men Alika, varför oroar du dig? You have God with you. Gud är med dig. Let's just pray. Vi ska be. And promise me that you gonna go and find any church in Helsingborg. Och lova mig att du går och letar upp en kyrka i Helsingborg. And um, uh, he said like, I, I, I said to him, how can I go to the church if I don't speak English? Och jag sa, men hur kan jag gå i kyrkan om jag inte kan engelska? He said, don't care, God, God can care everything. Han sa, var inte orolig, Gud tar hand om allt. I remember, you know, like, like that moment, right? like it was just, just five minutes ago, I remember it clear. Och jag kommer ihåg det så tydligt, precis som att det var bara fem minuter sedan. And I found the uh, Victory Center in the internet. Vi har hittat Victory Center på nätet. And I was, you know, like shaking that Sunday when I was wanting to go to this church. Och jag var nervös, jag skakade när jag skulle gå dit. Like, uh, what, what, what should I say when I will come? Och jag tänkte, vad ska de säga när jag kommer? And when I came, first directly I met Andrea. Och när jag kom dit så mötte jag direkt Andrea. And she was, she was, You know, like, it was like a cloud <laughs> around <laughs> her of the happiness, joy and the um, uh, kindness. Och det var liksom som ett mållått henne av glädje och godhet. And she was like, oh, welcome, welcome, what is your name? Come in, come in, come in here. Och hon sa, välkommen, välkommen, vad heter du? Kom in, kom in. And then, I was so 
glad the time that Andrea was so happy to meet me that but she didn't know me, <laughs> but she was happy anyway. <laughs> oh, I was so glad that Andrea was so glad that Martha my pastor and the shelter me. And I just stayed at this church. Och jag stannade kvar i den här kyrkan. I didn't understand the preaching at all. Jag förstod ingenting om predikan. I was using my translator like every uh, second word. <laughs> Och jag använde min uh, översättare på vartannat ord. <laughs> But I just trust God and I, and I, I just stay. Men jag litade på Gud och jag stannade kvar. Then one day, like uh, one situation was happened with me that I had no place to stay, to sleep over. Och jag hade också ett problem att jag hade ingenstans att bo. And pastor family they invited me to to stay with them. Och pastor och hans fru de bad mig att bo hos dem. And you know, you know, you know, like it was such a hard time in my life. Och det var svårt tid i mitt liv. Like I didn't have friends. Jag hade inga vänner. Like it was really, really hard with the language. Or it was very difficult with speaking. Like you can't share at all what 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 do you feel inside. You can't share at all. Or man can't even share the whole alls that man shares in the day. You don't know how you're gonna survive here in another country without family, without anybody. Or I wish that I was gonna survive in a foreign land without my family, without anyone. But every day Andrea told me they was with me. But every day so Andrea told me with me. And you know, like I saw God's hand. Oh, I saw God's hand. In 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 every day, in, in each day. Every day, like like um, um, you know, like I prayed during maybe one year. I just prayed all the time, and I I just had a had faced it. God, what am I doing here and why do I go through all these circumstances? But I just, I chose that I want to be loyal. It's, it's, it doesn't matter what is happening, it doesn't matter what's going on, but I want to be loyal to God because I know He, he is my God, He is He's number one. He's my savior. He's the king. Well, men jag tänkte jag behöver ta vad som händer. Jag vill vara lojal till Gud. Han är han är min frälsa. Han är min kung. Han är det största i mitt liv. And you know, it was hard, but it was hard, but det var svårt, men during the year I got the job. Under året fick jag ett jobb. I got the job even the I didn't pray about it. Was like no, my prayer, and I got a job like I don't know, maybe fifty times better than I was prayed about, and I, that I was accepted. I feel the job so far fifty times better than I had prayed for. This one, and you know, I got um, before it was not allowed uh, for Ukrainian to visit the city. Innan så var det inte tillåtet för Ukraina att gå på SFI. But I was praying to God, I want to learn Swedish. <laughs> oh, men jag bad, snälla Gud, jag vill lära mig svenska. And you know, we got accepted to SFI. <laughs> Och jag fick lära mig. <laughs> so I started my SFI course two weeks ago. Så jag började med SFI för två veckor sedan. And it was, it was like something incredible and impossible. Because without personal number, you can't come into the course. Or they were like some hell, some miracle for just a person that was so common. But I did. And you know, like during this year, I got a lot of friends. Or that I also have had many friends. And you know, sometimes, actually, I got an apartment. I got a known apartment from migration agency as well. Well, I think I was an egal lager that from migration started. And it's like it's even much, much better that I accepted. Or that it makes it better than what I had a thought. So God like really doing miracles in my life, like every day. So every day, every day. Every day, every day. Every day, every day. Every day. And you know, like because we are like human beings, we are human beings. 
every day can find something, something is not perfect and I want to have something better. Så uh, hittar vi alltid saker som inte är som vi vill och vi vill ha bättre saker. So I can find some things to complain. Man kan alltid hitta något att klaga på. Unfortunately. <laughs> Tyvärr. But I ask um, forgiveness. Men jag bad om förlåtelse. And I ask God to, to, to learn me how to, to appreciate every small thing. Och jag bad Gud att hjälpa mig att uppskatta alla små saker. And you know, one day I ask God, like, what, what, what am I doing here? Like, my life, okay, now I have everything. I have job, I have friends, I have church. Nu så har jag allting. Jag har ett jobb, jag har vänner, jag har församlingen. I have everything what I was praying about. Jag har allting som jag bad om. But there is something that I feel I want more. Men jag känner ändå att jag vill ha mer. And I ask God, why do I go through all these circumstances? Jag frågade Gud, varför går jag igenom det här? And you know, I, I, didn't, I, I couldn't get an answer. Och jag fick inget svar. And one day I got it. Men en dag så kom det. He told me, han sa till mig, because I want you to understand. Jag vill att du ska förstå. You don't need anybody. Du behöver ingen. But me. Förutom mig. You don't need anybody. Du behöver ingen. But him. Mm. Förutom honom. You know it's so incredible. Det är otroligt. It's so great to understand it. Det är så stort att förstå det här. Because it's a truth. Och det är en sanning. You know, like we are here on this earth only temporary. Vi är bara här på jorden en kort tid. Whatever is going on, och vad som händer, it doesn't matter. Så spelar det ingen roll. You need only him. Du behöver bara honom. You need only his power. Du behöver bara hans kraft. And only his love. Hans kärlek. Mm. And we already have it. Och vi har det redan. Today. Dark. Right now, just now. It's already a big blessing that we can be here today in the church and just praise Him. What a fantastic that we can be here in the church and to be here with Him. So, yeah. My message today is: we need only Him. So I will say that we need only Him. Yeah. So don't concentrate all small things or big. Big troubles in our life because he he's bigger. So think it for dinner small or still a problem, but Han is stuff. Anyway, he's bigger than any problem. Han is stuff than all problem. And for today we don't we can't understand why do we go through some situation. Och här och nu kan vi inte förstå varför vi går igenom vissa saker. But he knows. Men han vet. We have just to trust him. Så vi behöver bara lita på honom. To keep going because we know our way and our goal. Och bara fortsätta för vi vet ju vårt mål och vägen. To enter the kingdom of God. Och att komma fram till Guds rike. Our permanently house. Och till vårt hem för evigt. And I want to repeat it. You, need, you don't need anybody but him. Jag vill säga det igen. Du behöver ingen annan än honom. May God bless everyone. Och må Gud välsigna er alla.